So what are countries saying? South Korea's Personal Information Protection Commission, which is the country's information privacy group, is asking DeepSeek how personal information of users is managed, and then they'll make their decisions about whether or not DeepSeek will be made available in South Korea or not. Italy completely banned DeepSeek within the country due to a lack of transparency regarding user data and handling. And the Italian Data Protection Group is sending requests to DeepSeek asking for more information on data handling and then where it obtained its training data. So they're concerned about that as well. Belgian consumer privacy organization Testencoop filed a complaint that DeepSeek might not be complying with the GDPR rules, very serious. And they opened a complaint which is prompting Belgium to investigate. Portugal's consumer privacy organization filed a complaint with the Portuguese Data Protection Authority. France and Ireland have also been investigating as well. So countries around the world are all eyes on DeepSeek, all eyes on China, trying to get an understanding for how the model was trained, how the data input is being handled, and whether or not it's secure, whether or not it's being stored, uh, whether or not it's being handed over to the Chinese government. They are, they are skeptical at best about the DeepSeek model. And I think that's with good reason.